Ah, Amiga DOS once again. And what's that? It looks like... Oh, yeah, it looks like the cursor for one Amiga. The biggest selling Amiga magazine in the UK in some sort of 90s period. Uh, specifically around 1993 for this example because this is Psycho Santa which came on the January 1993 edition of One Amiga and if we can start it using some sort of skill and finesse apparently not apparently this takes longer to load than you might expect from your casual game um, yeah, this is the sort of game which the British were great for and it's a game which I miss immensely because you just don't get this sort of game anymore I mean you can get festive games and stuff for PCs which you can download from Tinternet but nothing slammed into your face on a cover disc like this I mean this was a full game for the I mean, is it gonna start can we have some sort of maybe I should oh there we go I've got to press fire shareware message this game is shareware yep we know. But it's a full game. There we go. And that was a trump from Santa's ass because this game is filled with childish humour and Christmas music. Which just makes it even more lovable. And yeah, I mean, you can get stuff like Steam. You can download. Steam has made games like this more back in your face and more abundant. But there's loads. And back in, back in the day, you used to get little, little games like this and it's just uh, piles of crap but that's not the point so you have to drop parcels into the house by going past and timing it right so that the parcel flies out the back of the sleigh as you're going over the house um, it's, I don't seem to be able to drop the parcel why won't you drop a parcel? Come on, Santa. You can do it. Am I doing something terribly wrong here? I put, got, I got a few parcels. Do I need to collect some more? Maybe I need to collect some more. Let's go and visit some people. Oh my god! What the hell is that guy? Guy... No, he's a bit... Oh my god, that's not very festive, is it? What's he got there? What's that guy? Is that a snowman pooping out icicles? No, he's... No, okay, okay. Okay, I've got a present. Now I can drop out the house. Okay, where's the house? Come on. Yes! Yes! Is that in? Come on! Come on! Yes! The job is done! I have blessed the house with presents galore! Well done. Prepare for the bonus level. Now this is where you get to hop around on a pogo stick. Timing your pogoing nicely so you get higher, lifting us higher and higher into the sky. -er. Come on! It's actually quite a good fun, this game. I like this game. It's very festive. Oh no, I've lost my bounce. I've lost my mojo! Okay, it's all about timing. It's all about timing. Come on. Oh, Sandy, you fat knacker! Come on! I think LGR reviewed this game several years ago. But it's very unique to Britishness. You know, if you're an outsider from a different country and you see this game, you'd probably be like, what the fuck is this? And to be fair, that's exactly what the British were like. But <laughs> it just makes it all the more funny. Yeah, this is by Bill Bullfrog. So, you know, it's not a crappy little software house. Big publishers used to go out and make games like this just for the sake of it. Just for a bit of festive fun. Halloween specials, Christmas specials, anything special, anything. Oh yeah, I get turkey. And it, if you eat turkeys, I believe, Santa becomes, yeah, he gets fatter and he becomes harder to, con to control. I think you need to keep eating the, why are there turkeys just flying out of that house? Just taking a little stroll. Yeah, it's not ideal having the presents fly out the back like this. It'd be easier if they dropped vertically down, but it's a game of skill, of course, and timing. And I seem to have none. I think I need to find some more presents. Hello, mate. Hello, you festive bastard. Is that the ghost of Christmas past or something? Christmas future? 
I can Scrooged. Oh, what a film Scrooged is. I'm gonna have to watch that this year. I'm gonna have to, I've only got a few days left before Christmas to watch it. Come on, get a present in the house. Why? Sometimes the presents just don't seem to fly out the back of the sleigh. What's going on with those reindeer? Why are there only two? And why are they not attached to the sleigh? They're just kind of floating. Still, they're pretty efficient at what they do. Right, let's go and find some more. Santa, you're dead! Oh, no. oh better luck next year. Oh, I guess we'll have to wait till then. Anyway, that's Psycho Santa for the Commodore Amiga from 1992. Ah, see you tomorrow for the next one. Goodbye.